Hey, by now you guys know the New England Patriots have developed a nice reputation for developing and producing solid cornerbacks in the National Football League. However, there's an entire generation out there that doesn't know or won't remember the man who kicked it all off. That man's name is Ty Law. Hi, I'm Chad Wilson, the owner of All Eyes DB Camp and the AllEyesDBCamp.com website. I train defensive backs from ages 13 all the way into the pros, and I'm happy to have had a long list of guys that have been successful under my tutelage. I love talking about the history of the game because that's how we prepare ourselves for what's coming down in the future. And I'm happy to bring this series to you. Know your DB history. And I'm very happy to bring this particular defensive back to your attention. It's Ty Law. Football fans' discussions about who's the best from the previous era usually centers around names like Champ Bailey and Charles Woodson, right before them, Deion Sanders or Rod Woodson. Lost in the greatness of all those individuals is a lockdown cornerback named Ty Law. Who knows why some guys' greatness gets kicked under the table, but have no fear. Chad Wilson's here to help place the Law resume front and center back onto the desk in front of you. Law began his football career in Beaver Creek, Pennsylvania at Aliquippa High School. What should shock you is that Law was the first of two NFL Hall of Fame cornerbacks to come from that very same high school. Also hailing from the same halls of Aliquippa was everyone's favorite one-on-one cornerback, Darrell Revis. Perhaps Revis had a man to look up to as he was coming up because Ty Law was it. Law was a three-sport athlete at Aliquippa playing football, basketball, and running track. Like Revis after him, Law would be a solid basketball player and be named his team's MVP. In football, Law played all over the place for the Quips. His time on the gridiron saw him line up at safety, cornerback, running back, and wide receiver. Following his high school career, Law would sign with and then attend the University of Michigan. In Ann Arbor, Law had a solid but unremarkable career. He would letter three seasons and did make all Big Ten in his final two seasons, but he was not a Thorpe Award winner or Heisman Trophy candidate like his fellow Michigan alum that came after him, Charles Woodson. Law was good enough, though, to enter the NFL draft after his junior year and saw his time for the maize and blue end with eight career interceptions. In the 1995 NFL draft, Law would be picked 23rd overall by the New England Patriots and coach Bill Parcells. Ironically, Law would play for three Hall of Fame coaches while playing for the Patriots, Parcells, Pete Carroll, and Bill Bell. Belichick. Law would then become a starter midway through his rookie season and go on to nab three interceptions during his initial campaign. He would duplicate that three interception performance the following year as the Patriots went to the Super Bowl. When new coach Pete Carroll came to town, Law would have yet another three interception season and tally 11 pass breakups. His fourth year would be what you would call his breakout year. In 1998, few, if any, could say they were better than Ty Law. In a league that had the likes of Deion Sanders, Rod Woodson, Charles Woodson, and Eric Eric Allen playing in it, Law surpassed them all with nine interceptions to lead the league. That would earn him his first Pro Bowl selection and a $50 million contract the following season. Law's budding NFL career would reach rock star status throughout his time with William Belichick as he came to town in 2000. As a master of defensive schemes, Belichick crafted and unleashed a weapon in Law to quell opponents' passing attacks. Law would find himself matched up on an opponent's best wide receiver and would severely limit their effectiveness. Explosive offenses like the Peyton Manning Indianapolis Colts started to sprout up and Belichick used Law extensively in his scheme to frustrate them. The sticky coverage by Law was an integral part early Super Bowl runs by the Belichick Patriots. In 2001, the Patriots won their first Super Bowl and Law played an important part picking off Kurt Warner in the game and returning it 47 yards for a touchdown. Just the season before, the Kurt Warner-led Rams ran through the league with their high-flying passing attack and won the Super Bowl. In five seasons with Belichick, Law would earn three Super Bowl rings, make the Pro Bowl five times, and be named All-Pro twice. In 2005, Law's time with the Patriots was up and he moved on to division rivals New York Jets. Showing everyone that he was not done yet, Law turned in his best statistical year as a pro, collecting 10 interceptions for 195 yards, one touchdown for 74 yards. He would also add 18 pass deflections to the stat sheet to go along with a fumble force and another recovery. For the second time in his career, Law would lead the NFL in interceptions. The lockdown defender from Aliquippa High School and the University of Michigan would go on to play four more years in the NFL with the Jets, Chiefs, and Broncos before retiring in 2009. In his 15 years as a pro, Law would rack up a ton of honors. This included three Super Bowl titles out of four appearances, five Pro Bowl selections, two All-Pro honors, all 2000 NFL Decade Team, and in 2019, he was named to the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Law's career can stand up to anyone else who's played this game at the position 
position of cornerback. Hope you guys are duly informed now. Know your DB history. Ty Law. If you are looking to take your game to the next level, be sure to join me in the All Eyes DB Camp members area. Click on the link in the description down below. Got over 200 videos in there designed to take you to the elite level. Coverages, drills, tips, techniques, coverage analysis, everything you need to be the best that you can be. Finally, once again, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell so that you're informed the next time we put out great DB content like this. And as always, All Eyes DB Camp, consistency breeds results. I'm <laughs> sorry.